Hey, tiny island adventurers. From the moment you step in, you'll notice the whimsical charm of Call Me Gabby. It's not just a restaurant, it's an experience. A place where the Miami elite come to dine, and if you're lucky, you might just spot a celebrity or two. Now, I'm not saying that you'll rub elbows with the likes of Jared Kushner or Jeff Bezos, but let's just say this isn't your average dollar slice pizza joint. It's exclusive, sure, but with a slide of pretentiousness that's hard to swallow. But hey, if you got the cash to splash, why not live a little? Just remember to tip your server well, they might just be the gatekeeper for your next reservation. But the real star here is the food. From their interesting pizzas to their mouth-watering pasta and appetizers, every dish is a testament to authentic Italian cuisine. Great for Yes. Oh, this place is absolutely beautiful. Do you like this place, guys? Oh, it looks very nice. Call me Gabby. Look at the classy menus. Just regular Still. tap water. Hey, Janine is suggesting a pizza for me. Giada. Giada. It has seafood. Oh, okay. I used to like it. Play. I know. That's, I, I okay. think you might want something else, but I just bought that. It's Giada. Okay. Now, I'm kind of hungry. They have a, a gourmet and a miniature gourmet. What's the difference? But if we get the salami and stuff first. Okay. We're at Call Me Gabby tonight. We're excited. We got a chance to speak with some of the people who make Call Me Gabby so special. Hey guys, would you like something with something to drink? Oh, it's fine. We're fine with the water. Can we get um, to start off with a cacciatore platter okay. and a grilled vegetable platter? Yes, ma'am. Thank you. The bread pasta. The lechon pasta. The pasta. That's why we have all inside is closed and rolled. There's no hole inside. No. I'm gonna get pizza. Okay. I'm gonna just get a regular margarita pizza. What are you gonna get? Are you thinking the pasta? Don't do it just because if you do get what you really want. What are you gonna get? I'll be the one who gets pasta. Picture this. What native Italian server approaches your table? Wow, this is, looks real. Oh, look at the presentation, guys. This is amazing. I'm gonna get your pizza. Yeah, I think you should. Right. I gotta get a picture. Bon appetito, enjoy. Oh, I thank you. Okay, so these are the grilled vegetables. Mm -hmm. Charcuterie board, because I know you made the one on the video. And what is this, focaccia? Focaccia. Focaccia. It's probably like what Yes. My focaccia is very crispy. There's a little bit of butter on it. So Janine knows charcuterie boards, and you notice there are olives, nuts, and for the palate, you have different types of meats and some grapes. Really? Pay attention to all the details here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I finally gonna know what is. <laughs> yes, I think you intrigued. I, I'm, yeah. I'm getting the seafood pizza. The, the Gianna, I think it is. Giada. Giada, yeah. Giada. Thank you, thank you. Mm Well, bring us our food. Sure, she's got the pasta. That's exactly what you thought it was going to be. Well, I don't know. It may be absolutely delicious. It's probably delicious, but that wouldn't fill you up. That's a normal portion, but we should be eating, right? I want to see yours. What did you get? Uh, seafood. seafood. Okay, Jim. They're bringing my pizza now. Oh, uh, thank you. Welcome, enjoy. Okay. Oh, you were right. Excuse me. 
Now how come, oh, this is a mini pizza. Because and you get a bigger pizza. Yeah. So let's compare them in size. Oh, thank you. So this is a difference. Now Regina thinks because they have more expensive ingredients on the mini one. So Janine, what do you think? You're about half, 50% bigger? Yeah, be careful. You're going to drop okay. it and then you want to basically try it. Sure. Does it make any sense to you now that I show you? Yes. That uh, I cannot explain you in another way than it's from like a short pasta, mm -hmm. like a pan, but uh, with no hole. Yeah. This is homemade. Pan yeah. cannot be homemade, but this one is yes. the homemade version yes. of the pan. Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. Tasting it. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. So good. So now that we're looking at the dessert menu here at Gabby's. Definitely. Oh, is this like a dessert pizza? Served with a side of sweet. What do we got, Janine? Panna cotta with berries and different dessert pieces. One with the Nutella, chocolate, both right? Yeah, that's fried in the You're talking like the Hungry Howie dessert pizzas, like yeah, with the apples? Fancy. But fancier than Hungry Howie's. Yeah, but oranges okay. and chocolate. It's in the Italian ice cream. Italian ice cream. I like it. But we didn't have any drinks. Three of us came in at 160 bucks. That's not bad. That's we had not, a lot not of bad. Good food. And you said the tip is already in here, right? They said the tip would be. Well, the tip's already in. It's including the tip. So this is a, a good deal in Miami. Not here, but it's good. Grazie very much. Thank you. Oh, I love the tile going up to the second floor. Sophia Lorraine, I love you, baby. Now we're running the second floor. Oh, I just love the decoration here. Oh, what an intimate bar. And if you thought it couldn't get any better, wait till you see the view from their second floor dining. Very classy. Well, the food was pretty good here. And if you like this video, hit like, subscribe, and comment.